Welcome to Top Shelf. I am Brother Beer. Today I am looking at Wells and Young Banana Bread Beer. Now, the reason I'm looking at this beer is because I know that there's probably a few people out there that have seen it on the shelf, thought about it, and then gone, nah, it's a bit of a risk, I'll just get something else. I'm taking that risk for you. I've bought it because, and it's not really that much of a risk because, in all honesty, I have actually had it before, so I know it's okay. So, here we go. Let's open it up and have a look. Now, it is actually brewed with bananas. They get their own fair trade bananas, um, which is good to know. As you can see, you don't get much of a head with it. It's not particularly carbonated as well. Like It's not like really bubbly or anything like that, which is, you don't want it to be like soft drink. You want it a bit subtle. It does have, even though the heads just disappear, there might be a bit of a result of the glass. It does have a really lovely golden honey color to it. And um, straight off the bat, you can really smell the, the banana bread. It's, it's, it's not an in-your-face artificial smell. It does smell natural, which is nice. And it, some flavored beers and things that you can get these days, it really does taste artificial and fake. This doesn't, smells like the real deal. And taste-wise, Yeah, look, it's a really nice, pleasant, if you do like banana, banana sort of in your beer. And, and think about that crystal weasen that I did the other other week. It had a subtle banana peel flavor included into that. This actually does have bananas incorporated into the brewing process. So it is a little bit more prominent, but it is, it does say banana bread beer. It really does taste like banana bread. Toasted, maybe with a little bit of butter because it's got a slightly oily characteristic that comes along with it as well. Probably some mild sort of spice notes that are in there just to sort of just give it a little bit more complexity. It's not heaps to this beer because it is mainly just trying to be that banana bread beer and it is exactly what it is. Um, but it is surprisingly pleasant to drink. So don't be too risk averse in, in terms of trying something like this. I think you can give this a go and enjoy it. If you can get your hands on some nice quality pretzel, something salty like that, that's, that's good. That is going to match something like this amazingly well. Um, I thoroughly enjoy this sort of beer. Uh, Wells and Young do do quite a few different nice things. Uh, I'd like to get my hands on the double chocolate stout that they do as well. If you get around to getting to that before I do, uh, write in and let us know. But give this a try and also let us know what you think of it. Banana bread beer. It's just, it's something a little bit different. It's quite easy to drink. It's not, because it's not artificial, it doesn't have the syrupy, nasty clagginess hanging around. Um, it's pleasant, clean kind of finish. Uh, not dry, just, just sort of ends off. Um, but yeah, look, go, buy, try, then like and subscribe. Brother Beer.